نجهز لرمضان ولا شرب ولا أي نوع من الأكل ولا أي نوع من المشروبات في رمضان فساعة الإفطار راح تكون أكل متنوع Muslim people think of Ramadan as kind of punishment, right? Because why you spend all these hours and no food or water? They don't know the, the main idea of fasting in Ramadan, which is feeling and people who are in need. I don't really want people to think we are suffering in Ramadan. <laughs> We are from Syria. We came to Canada from Lebanon six years ago. Uh, Maryam, my daughter. I have uh, two daughters, Maryam and Maria, and uh, three boys, Dali and Ahmed and Omran. My sister got married and she has a girl now. She's 45 days old. <laughs> I uh, used to love more uh, Ramadan in Syria. Allah Akbar. We feel Ramadan more in Syria here in Canada because we are kind of, uh, you can say, uh, alone. <laughs> the only family who is fasting here, uh, maybe in my neighborhood. So it's kind of tough. But it is uh, still uh, very meaningful for me. <laughs> In Ramadan, we have special meals. It's called Uzi, right, Mom? Yeah, it's Uzi. <laughs> so we brush uh, the, the filo pastry with the ghee. And then you can fill it with some nuts, meat, and the rice with Carrots, green beans. So fatta is very popular in Syria and Syrian families love to have it. First of all, the pita bread and then the chickpeas. Yogurt with tahini and garlic. And then the the hot ghee on top. Yeah, this dish is called fatte. We break the fast with dates. We have uh, special kinds of drinks. We have a special dessert. And they are actually connected to Ramadan because they help you to get energy. <laughs> It was very hard in the beginning when we came to Canada. You have to learn a new language, you have to find a job, uh, you have to study, but it was the most challenging thing to find friends. But when we get to know more people, life became easier. This is really a night of Ramadan because we always expect someone to come at night. <laughs> Miriam, say hi. Yeah, you have to. <laughs> Hi, 
امبارح عم بقول لهم لسه وينها مريم ما مبينه خلاص يعني خسرناها كثير غرقانه كلنا عم بيجي بقول لهم حكوا مع ريا شوفوا وينها كيفك ابو حمار ات ذا اند اوف ذا داي دونت ونت تو بريك يور فاستنج الون هاتي هاتي لك هاتي مشكله بتكلفي هيك تقريبا شيء شيء رمضان استقامة بعلمك كيف تكوني أكثر جيدة كيف تسامحي كيف تشعري بكل اللي حواليك تكون قلبك كتير كبير I have never imagined that we're gonna have war in Syria. But when the war started in Syria, to be honest, um, I was very weak. I couldn't imagine like I can go to the street and cover or take photos or videos of what going on. Uh, maybe because I was, uh, it was very, emotional for me, you know, like my family or my friends, and it's real, it's here close to me. Um, I can't do anything. But when, when I came to Canada, I started majoring in journalism. I said, yeah, thanks God, I'll be a journalist. And one day I'll talk to the world what we have been through in Syria. We have a special meal uh, before the sunrises. It's called Al Suhoor. And then we pray. This is what Ramadan means for us. It's a new start. 